Welcome here to more Talk FCB and welcome to the channel here today, guys, where we are discussing Lionel Messi and especially that desire now to return to Barca. And I want to talk especially about the two moments in this transfer situation that has really led to Messi deciding on that return to Barca because there was two really distinct moments. Number one, we've got to go back to the World Cup in December of 2022 because don't forget, after the World Cup we heard from Gerard Romero, suddenly everything changed with Messi. One minute, he was ready to renew with PSG. There was discussions, there was real optimism from PSG that he would stay. But after the World Cup, everything changed. And it was not only there about winning it, Messi winning it with Argentina, but it was the way that it happened. It was the way that they did it. Messi there, the level that he was able to reach. And I think, don't forget there, coming off the back of what was a tough first season at PSG, to then go to the World Cup and perform at the level he did, it was wonderful. It was absolutely top quality. And that World Cup campaign made Messi realise, you know what? I'm not done. I am not done yet at the top level. I can still mix it with the very best. I can still be the very, very best. And that was when he decided this next move for me, it may be away from PSG, but we still didn't know whether it would be a move to Barca. We still didn't know whether he would want to really return to this club until last Sunday. The second moment arrived there at the Kings League, at the Spotify camp now, with over 90,000 fans in attendance, who then proceeded to chant Messi's name. His name again rang around the stadium. And don't forget, Messi wasn't even there. He wasn't involved in that tournament. That was simply about their Barca fans hearing the possibility of Messi coming back, hearing just a murmur that it might be possible and responding in a huge way. And I thought it was incredible yesterday. Aguero there, he was asked, did Messi see those chants? Romero said that he did. Did he actually witness what was done inside the stadium? Aguero said, of course he did. He said, it seems like that day was the key. And I think that is so, so significant there. The timing of those chants inside the camp. Now, the love from the fans just after, don't forget, Messi had been whistled by the PSG fans. And I think Messi realises here, number one, he can still compete at the very top level. He still has that desire. He showed that with Argentina to be right up there. And number two, he wants to be somewhere where he is loved. He wants to spend the last years of his club career at a club that is his home, where he feels appreciated. And that all means right now, he wants to return to Barca. And the wheels, as we know, are in motion. And so that indeed, guys, was for me the two moments where Lionel Messi's future really unfolded before his own eyes. He knows what he wants, and in these coming weeks, we are going to be finding out whether he can get it this summer. That unbelievable return that it would be. Please do let me know all of your thoughts in the comments down below on what we've discussed today and this Messi situation as a whole. I will, of course, see you soon. We'll be starting Classico build-up very soon across the two channels. I'm really excited for that and I will see you then. Thank you for all of your support but until next time as always Vishka El Barca. Oh.